hello everyone welcome back to our video in this video we will add shadow effect to our logo so for that we have created our nested sequence and we have also duplicated our nested sequence and we are adding an effect called vertical fit to our second nested sequence what it does is that it flips our logo vertical fit now change the position of our second layer set second nested layer and bring it down where you want to add shadow now we will apply second effect that is Gaussian Blur drag Gaussian Blur to your nested sequence and go to effects control panel change the values for blurriness so now you can see it is giving shadow type look we have increased blurriness to 40% uh, let us increase it more 64% would be good now to give it more real kind of look we are reducing its opacity so reduce opacity of this sequence to 66 percent or you can also reduce it further i am keeping it near to 60 60% would be good or you can say 50% so we are keeping the opacity at 50% so now you can see it is looking like shadow and since the sequence has all the animation applied to it it will move in similar manner as your logo so it is like a duplicate of your logo what we have done is that we have mirrored 